Good morning, everyone, and happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. We're halfway through the week. And this week, I'm very happy um, to get through, honestly. Not because I'm so anxious for the weekend or so excited for the weekend, even though I am. But because this week, I really decided to start... Um, uh, putting a start to some things and putting an end to other things like our our goal last week and it's slipping my mind right now what the actual goal is but when we talked about how we have to start something oh initiate I think I can't remember but how we have to start some things um, and in starting some things you're gonna recognize that you also have to stop other things so I've been doing that this week and I officially started I didn't really start on Monday like I should have but I started yesterday um, one of the things was water um, and trying to go to bed at a good time and wake up at a good time and I'm trying to do it like day by day or each day add something new or every other day add something new because I don't want to overwhelm myself because sometimes you know you try to hit things hard like you try to give up sugar you try to give up carbs you try to drink a gallon of water you try to go to bed at eight you try to wake up at seven or wake up at four or something like that that's not me I try to go to bed at like 10 10 30 um, but you try to do all these things at once and then you end up just not doing any of it at all because it was just too much, at least for me. So I try to attack one thing at a time. Yesterday was water, which was great. I finally hit my water goal. It's been a really long time since I've hit my water goal, um, but I finally hit my water goal again. And moving forward, I'm looking forward to hitting it every single day. So happy wednesday people let's get right into today's goal as always god is blessing us he's always going to be blessing us the goal for today is to be distinguished okay be distinguished and to be distinguished it means that you are set apart or you are conspicuous conspicuous which is um noticeable or oh well really that's just it just noticeable for doing something great or you're just set apart you're different you're marked as something um as something special if you think of um, when you, I actually, if you think of something that you partake, I actually don't use distinguish in my everyday vocabulary, so I don't know if I need to add this in, but if you think of something as being distinguished, you should think of it as it's being set aside for a particular purpose or set aside for a particular reason. So of course, we all know by now, we're in the last month of the year, I've been preaching about it, all year practically but we all know that we have been set aside or set apart for a particular purpose what that purpose is you know some of you may have already um, figured out what your purpose is some of you may still be on the road to figuring out what your purpose is regardless of that we know that we have been set aside for a particular purpose so when we're thinking about being distinguished today we honestly want to think about not fitting in and I know, especially for some adults, like I feel like adults a lot of times overlook that um, that phrase or that thing of not fitting in because they're like, oh, I'm not in high school. Like I don't try to fit in with, you know, X, Y, and Z. But whether you realize it or not, that's exactly what you do when you conform or when you um, do something that is outside of your purpose or you do something that is out, that you know you probably shouldn't be doing, but you're like, oh, you know, everybody's doing it, so I'm going to do it anyway. That's you trying to fit in, and I do it all the time. Or even when you know your purpose and you try to bring other people in, it's not necessarily that you're fitting in, but you're trying to fit them in to your purpose when you know that they're outside of your purpose. So today we are making sure, number one, that we are honing in on what our purpose is. Um, if you know it, fabulous. If not, again, I'm still praying for you, but try to hone in on what you think your purpose is. Of course, you can always pray and ask God. You know, you can read literature to tell you that it will help you find what your purpose is in life but try to hone in you could take like tests or whatever i don't know try to hone in on what your purpose is and when you do that make sure that you are setting yourself aside or that you are distinguishing yourself from other people or other situations um that align with your purpose so you're setting yourself aside to align with your purpose and you're not trying to fit other people in that don't belong there and you're not trying to fit in to other places where you don't belong i mean because have you ever tried to fit you know those little um 
those little toys my nieces have them where it's like a circle a square and a star um, cut out and then they have like the pieces the circle the square and the star you have to put them in have you ever tried to fit the circle in the square it ain't gonna work it's not gonna work regardless of if you think that it's gonna work or not it's not gonna work because it wasn't purposed to go into the square slot it was purposed to go into the circle slot so find your slot okay don't try to fit into another don't try to fit into the star slot if you're a square or don't try to fit into the circle squat the circle slot if you are a star you know every god has designed a specific purpose for each one of us we have to figure out what that purpose is and then understand that we are designated for that particular purpose so we've been set aside for that purpose don't try to fit into anything else and don't try to bring anybody else along with you because that's just extra baggage so you know if god called them to be with you and to help you in your purpose or for you to help them in their purpose then he'll he'll make everything match up if not you're gonna more than likely find some find some resistance or just gonna be a harder road and i don't know sometimes we fight too hard for things that god's saying let go so yeah so that's a, I think that's another topic for another day. But yes, today's goal is to be distinguished. Hope everyone has a wonderful Wednesday and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.